I talk to a lot of fishermen that really enjoy using light gear to catch their fish. And I'm not talking just panfish or smaller trout, even for larger game fish. Now there is a limit to using light gear outfits. For example, I would never encourage someone to fish for muskie using an ultralight. Because even a small muskie, if you take a long time to bring it in, the chances of survival decrease. But for fish like walleye, pike, smallmouth, and largemouth bass, it's fine to use an ultralight. And that's one of the reasons why Barb and I are using ultralights today. Now the two ultralight outfits that we've been using are designed to be used with line from about two to six or two to eight pound test. For example, this one that I'm holding up in my hand is part of the Rapala series and it's called an F2. And F stands for finesse. So the two for a two piece spinning outfit. This particular one is six feet long and it's rated for line from two to six pound test. And you can see that I have one of the smallest Rapala reels on here. And it's loaded with 10 pound test braid, which is pretty heavy line, even though it's only rated for two to six pound. But remember the diameter of this 10 pound test braid is only only four pound test, so you're fine using it. Now you'll notice that beside the rod being light and being short, that this one has a split grip, so we don't have a full handle of cork here. That means that it's gonna be extremely sensitive. And the way our fishing has been today, all of our fish have been to, from about 17 to about 26 inches. So those are really nice walleyes that most people will use medium action spinning outfits to catch them. But you know what? With ultralights, they're even more fun. And we haven't really lost any fish.